Welcome to you, my name is Press and today we have a real beast in our hands, the Asus Republic of Gamers G752VS. Aside from the hardware changes, the G752VS does not differ from his predecessor, the G752VT. The lid is fully covered in aluminum, with an Asus backlit rock logo in the middle and two orange LED stripes on each side. The rest of the device features plastic imitating brushed aluminum. It would have been a nice finishing touch if the plastic elements in the interior were actual aluminum. You can easily distinguish the opening for the subwoofer, the two grills on the service cover which is detachable and gives access to two of the RAM slots, the 2.5 inch drive and the two M.2 PCIe SSD slots. The hinges are ok and the lid lifts up easily without using both hands. Matte finish is the dominating surface for the interior around the keyboard and touchpad, so it's prone to smudges and fingerprints, so frequent cleaning would be necessary. It's now hefty as hell, tipping the scale at 4.5 kg, and at its thickest point the device is 51 mm. Once again we would like to stress on the fact that the G752VS is an excellent built machine. Yes, it might not be the prettiest, but who are we kidding? If you buy this rock, you'll be too broke for a girlfriend to critique your taste anyway. The notebook uses an excellent well-known Full HD IPS panel, the LG LP173WF4SPF3. Aces are definitely following the motto, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. The display measures at 17.3 inches, has a pixel density of 127 ppi and a 0199 by 0199 millimeters pixel pitch. The display covers 90% of the sRGB color gamma, which means that almost all web-based colors can be reproduced. However, there is a really small part of the green, blue and red area that cannot be displayed. We develop unique profiles tailored for each individual display model. If you want color accuracy for working with Photoshop, CorelDRAW or just overall usage of the laptop, we'd recommend you the Office Work Web Design Profile that will maximize the color accuracy as much as the G752VS allows it. We tested the display with 24 commonly used colors and as you can see the difference before and after the profile for yourself. We didn't detect any pulse wave modulation or any screen flickering on the Asus ROG G752VT. This means that the display can be used for longer periods of time without affecting users with sensitive eyes. Here is where our health guard profile comes in handy. It limits the harmful blue light for the display and keeps the colors perceptually accurate. You can learn more about the health impact of the blue light emissions and our solution for it in the article that I have included in the top right corner of this video. Asus has included a subwoofer at the bottom to aid the main loudspeakers and make the multimedia experience fuller. Our test confirmed that the sound is crisp and full in low and mid frequencies with a little distortion in the high frequencies. Despite the large 90 watt hour battery, the Asus ROG 752VS had a subpar performance. For average use in web browsing, it withstands for 4 hours and 17 minutes. We doubt that you will start a gaming session without a charger, but out of the system you'll get around an hour and 15 minutes of playtime. But the inside of this baby is what it counts. The Core i7-6700HQ processor has 4 cores sticking at 2.6GHz and can go up to 3.5GHz for 1 active core and 3.1GHz for 4 active cores. The CPU is suitable for heavy applications and gaming. We compare the G752VS with other notebooks with the same CPU. You can check the full test and review in the laptop media website. The motherboard can hold up to 64GB of DDR4-2133 RAM, but our unit came with 3 free slots and only one being taken by a 16GB stick. Two of the slots are easily accessed under the service lid, but the other two require almost a full disassembly. The G752VS comes with the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1070. Due to its performance, thermals and power consumption, which is believed to be 10 watts more than the GTX 980, the GPU is suitable for large 17-inch laptops with the appropriate cooling solution. We decided to challenge this piece with two of the most played games in the past couple of years. We activated one of our unique profiles, the Gaming and Movie Nights one, that will better our visibility in the dark section of images. it came out with amazing results. We tested the CPU and GPU at 100% for a couple of hours to determine the reliability of the cooling system. The processor was at 3.1 GHz solid, but temperatures rose to 85 degrees Celsius. The GPU ran at 78 degrees Celsius, which is relatively high, but still preferable than thermal throttling. 
we consider the cooling system's performance to be more than excellent. Even under such high load, the chassis remained cool so the user won't feel a thing during the most intense and prolonged gaming sessions. Our final summation for the Asus ROG G752VS is that it's an excellent premium gaming notebook with fast storage solutions, two M2 PCIe NVMe SSD, ridiculously powerful GTX 1070 on board and a cooling system to support all of this demanding hardware. You can check the price of the laptop and the full review in the description below. In the review you will also find the buy our profile section, where you can acquire all the profiles for a low price.